be our point of view about fossil fuels. Fossil fuels is a combustible organic materials which we can call it as non-renewables such as coals, petroleum and natural gas that been derived from the remains of former life basically from dead plants and animals. Basic view upon fossil fuels it is a convenient source of energy that could generate lots of working power. One barrel oil equivalents to 23,300 women working for an hour. Fulfilling energy demands majorly in central heating for power plant, electricity generation and transportation. My point of view about renewable energy is an energy that comes from resources which are naturally replenished on a human time scale. An example of renewable energy such as solar, wind, geothermal, biomass and also hydropower. Renewable energy can replace conventional fuel in four distinct areas which is electricity production, heating, transportation fuel and also off-grid energy service. Wind can provide clean source of energy but it is variable. The amount of electricity produced depends on how much the wind blows. Similarly, sunlight can be converted into electricity without emitting carbon dioxide, but solar energy also suffers from variability. Geothermal energy is clean and continuous because the earth interior is always hot. It provides electricity when there is no wind and no sun. Hydropower uses the power of weight of water to turn the turbines. symbolizes a similar process as fossil fuels but relatively emit less carbon dioxide to atmosphere compared to fossil fuels.
Remove a drill to extract hot water below a surface. Pumping through a power plant that converts the heat to electricity and then inject the cooler water back underground to be reheated. One promising strategy start with a technique called carbon dioxide capture and storage or CCS. With CCS, a device is installed at a power plant and other stationary carbon dioxide source to remove or capture a CO2 before it is emitted in the atmosphere. Captured CO2 is compressed to a liquid. Then transported most likely by pipeline to a location where it can be pumped underground to large geologic reservoir. By putting CO2 underground rather than the atmosphere, CCS is another tool in our efforts to combat climate change. The amount of energy that can be produced is dependent on the different pressure between the wells. When CO2 is heated, the pressure changes much more and the energy yield is substantially greater as a result. Currently, the wind blows during low electricity demand when people are asleep. Spinning turbine produce electricity that goes to waste if the energy is not stored. But if the wind farm is located near to the CCS facility, that otherwise wasted electricity can be used to compress and pump CO2 into the reservoir 